I'm in a power zone, but my heart rate is climbing and it's doing something else. Which one do I follow? And it's so first of all, it's normal to see this. Absolutely normal. So it's cardiac drift. Um, I, there, other people have put different terms on it, but it's basically just the separation of heart rate from steady power output. Mm -hmm. Power output remains the same. Heart rate starts to drift away from it subtly over time. And it, 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 it's attributed to um, fatigue and slow twitch fibers. So more recruitment of you know, higher end fibers that require different fuel sources, um, dehydration, your blood gets a little more viscous and a little harder to pump. So it has to work a little harder. Um, regardless of what explains it, it's, it's going to happen. It's, mm -hmm. it's part of fatigue. It's, it's going to happen. Um, as far as, you know, does that mean, should I lower my, my effort so that my heart rate stays steady? I can't think of too many cases to support that unless you just know you're going to ride for a long, long time. Right. Um, out, outside of that, just forget about the heart rate and, and keep your effort level pretty steady. Um, over those long rides, there is a there's a benefit into depleting in depleting those fibers that that can go all day they start to fatigue and then you start to recruit up the continuum you get those mid twitch fibers and even some of the fast twitch fibers start to garner some of the aerobic ben or the endurance benefits that, that all of us are very much after so mm -hmm. it's not the worst thing to start cycling through that and to see your heart rate start to rise if you know you're starting to recruit muscle that wouldn't otherwise get recruited if you hadn't reached this point so not only like it's like you want it yeah, yeah. You want it to happen on the yeah, long I, I'm, Like I said, I'm hard pressed or I'm, have, I'm having a hard time trying to decide why you would just keep on tamping your heart rate or your power down, down, down to keep that heart rate exactly steady. It, it, personally, when I see this happen, I'm not sad. I'm actually like, oh, good. I'm getting the benefit. Like I'm actually making some change here. You know what I mean? Like it's, it's not a bad thing in my mind when I see that, when I see that drift away and change mm -hmm. like that. That's no problem. Um, and I guess, like you said, perhaps like, yeah, it depends a bit on the type of effort you want to do. Um, but, but really in the end, if you do see these things drifting farther apart, don't worry. And, and if you're doing a power-based workout power, you know, you want to focus on the work being done and the work being done is going to be driving things. And that's what you really want to focus on.